Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. Welcome to a special edition of Matt's RV Reviews. Today is November 23rd, and I am here at Airstream of Tampa, the number one Airstream dealership in the entire country. And today they have six or seven used class B's and B pluses. And I had to ask the general manager three times. I'm like, wait, this stuff is used and it's available right now? Guys, look at this. They have not one, but two Airstream Atlases and they are used and ready to roll right now. So first and foremost, their phone number is 813-452-6344. Make sure you tell them you saw it on Matt's RV Reviews. Now, we do have a link to our website if you would like to email about it, but let me tell you guys something. You really shouldn't do that. You should just call right away because this is used inventory and it doesn't last long. So let's just hop into the video. Uh, so very first is this awesome Airstream Atlas. Um, we're going to look at both Airstream Atlases. This is a 2020 Airstream Atlas. Uh, the suggested retail price is $264. They have it at $249.9, and there might be wiggle room. I'm going to be honest, there might not be wiggle room. I didn't even ask the GM, um, but when you give a call, that there, there, there might be something that they got going on here. Look at the nice paint job, and these are used, guys. This is freaking amazing. I'm, I'm all like, wait, how is this even here if it's used? And she said that they all just came in. So this one has the Murphy bed that's already down. We'll take a look at the next one with the Murphy bed up so you can see what it looks like. Um, this does, this is the newer chassis, which means it has the adaptive cruise control, the lane assist, this unit. Okay, it has plenty of fuel. Don't forget the key. I don't have the key though. Tell me the miles, please. Let's see if he can tell me the miles. Let me just, yeah, I don't have the key on me. I don't know the mileage, folks. I'm sorry about that. Um, very nice unit here. Nice leather seats, Airstream. There's the Murphy bed that's down. Right here's the TV lift. Very nice cabinetry. If you give them a call, they'll be able to tell you more about this with how many miles is on it. And then I'll get the uh, stock number for everyone so you know which one it's in reference to. Here's a little refrigerator and the bathroom area. This is amazing. So this is just like your leisure travel vans or your pleasure ways. People love these B pluses with the uh, Murphy beds and everything. And also right there, it is air ride suspension, which is cool. And then the stock number, this is in reference to, okay, VIN number 20137. And that is the 2020 Airstream Atlas with the Murphy bed. So the next one here is a 2019 Airstream Atlas. Very nice. 224 discounted to 209 VIN number uh, 69637 okay very nice we got the paint here and then you guys are able to see what um that Murphy bed looks like when it's all the way up Mercedes Benz okay and just so everybody knows when I call these a B plus what I mean is, it's it's like a B. The next ones are gonna be class Bs. They're gonna be unibody chassis with the vans. This is the B plus, is that nice smooth profile. You know what I'm saying? And then inside, you can see what this one looks like with the bed that's already murphied up. Very nice. Again, same floor plan, Airstream Atlas. This one does look a little different. Different cabinetry colors or something. Very nice. And okay, so that's why this one's significantly cheaper. I was wondering why this one was cheaper um, and it was only one year off. This one has the older Mercedes chassis. 
because it's a 2019 it doesn't have the adaptive cruise control and the lane assist don't get me wrong it's still the 188 horsepower uh, Mercedes V6 325 pound-feet of torque and the miles on this 10,114 miles that's amazing that's amazing and you're saving what forty thousand dollars to have the lane assist you can keep the lane assist i'm saving 40 grand my opinion and i mean this is a clean clean unit and it's one of those things if you're interested in one of these new give them a call um but the problem is you're going to be buying a 2023 or a 2024 uh because they're what 14 to 18 months out on these so it takes a takes a really long time to get these so it's one of those things where my opinion burn the hand is worth two in the bush okay let's take a look at the next one uh this one was already sold then it's this one here it's a 2016 airstream interstate gl 144 discounted to 129.9 the vin 27701 this is a four seater oh and this was the one okay so there's no batteries on this one right now or i couldn't get it started um so the engine's off look at how bright it still feels in here no lights and it's still super bright because the light cabinetry you have the seats back here the seats open up or the seat drops down to the back door opens up you got your tv here bathroom now this is a class b folks this is van life very small cramped areas but people love it um again this can safely seat seven people wow maybe more i mean there, there's seat belts there so um you know you got your four up there three in the back TV right there. Very nice. Again, 144 discounted 129.9. And this one has 24,017 miles. Very nice. Okay. Oh. So this one here is also a 2016. Same price, 144 discounted to 129.9. Different floor plan in here in different color schemes i can see that this one uh you got the seat here that swiveled all the way around okay oh i like it though oh, okay and all the windows are down um look at how long this uh this kitchen counter space is the dark cabinetry looks very rich especially with the light color furniture it looks absolutely fantastic sit back here kick it up this does drop down to make a bed. I'm watching TV while they're driving down the road. Very nice. This one definitely feels more open and spacious than the other one. But again, that other one's made to transport a lot of people. This one isn't. Big size refrigerator and everything. It's amazing to me how many uh, different floor plan schematics they can have in Class Bs. And just so everybody knows, this is VIN number 09970. Okay. This one's a 2018. 169 discounted 159. VIN number 10945. Oh, look at the walls. Do you know what that means? Look at this, y'all. This is the Tommy Bahama edition. Why don't you guys just relax, relax edition very nice here's the rear of them okay and let's check out the inside this looks fresh with the uh white exterior with the uh tommy bahama tan interior 2018 oh yeah this is cool looking very cool looking this is another four seater but look at this, look at the uh, Marlin, not a Marlin, a uh, Swordfish Embroidery. Very nice. Nice like teak looking 
uh, cabinetry. This is dropped down. So you guys can see it. You got the little swordfish right there. This is very nice. TV little swivel action. Like the little cutouts there. Again, I don't care if it's Tommy Bahama. It's still a Class B bathroom. And then, this one might have been dead. Holy smokes. Let's take a look, another look at how good of condition it's in. 50,279 miles. That's actually really impressive. You know, it has a lot of miles for, um, has a lot of miles for it being in such good a condition. And then here's the last one, 144.9 to 129.9, VIN number 98237. And I believe, yeah, this one was dead and I couldn't get the lights on for you. So we'll just peek in real fast. Uh, and again, guys, if you're interested in this, give them a call. They have pictures of all these. Somebody just left the batteries on and uh, I just can't figure it out and I have a meeting to go to in about 30 minutes. So, but again, you give them a call if you're interested in this and they will have everything worked out for you. They'll have pictures. They'll have this cleaned up, lit up and everything. And I think, yeah, it's not even telling me the mileage. Somebody left the lights on. They were like Motel 6. They'll leave the lights on for you. Well, guys, that's it. That's a little uh, video for today. Again, give them a call at 813-452-6344. Make sure you tell them, you tell, you talk to the GM Jessica, make sure you tell them you saw it on Matt's RV Reviews. Give them a call, put a deposit on it, buy it. These won't last long. Or you can always send me an email uh, by going to mattsrvreviews.com and clicking that first contact tab. Here's what I will say. They're used units. Call the dealership directly, truthfully. As much as I want you to go to Matt's RV, do both. Go to Matt's RV Reviews, let us, okay, that's what that's what we can do. Go to Matt's RV Reviews and let fill out the form. Let them know that, let me know that you did call the Airstream of Tampa because we like to keep track to make sure that, you know, we're doing a good job and we're staying employed. But at the same time, it's a used unit, so you need to call the dealership ASAP, put some money down on any of these units if you're interested in buying it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, leave a comment down below. Let me know if you uh, bought one of these, and we'll see you next time.